What if I told you that you are already living in the future and right now we have available in the market a device that is able to communicate with all other devices that floats around us and unify them in the same platform and give us the possibility to make some scenes, some rules, some flows in our home based on that information and even more give us the possibility to receive a WhatsApp message when something happened in our home. This is Homey Pro and in this video we're going to talk about it. So let's get started. Nice to have you back at CS Tech. I'm Claudio and before we start the video about Homey Pro 2023 I will make a small small disclaimer because we are not living in the country that we are speaking natively English. We are living in Romania. We have a channel in Romania and of course we receive a lot of messages from worldwide viewers that request us to make videos that we made in Romanian to make it in English in order to, under, to be understood by them. So this is our English review for Homey. If you don't understand my English please write, please write me in the comment area below. I will try my best to answer to all of your question. So let's focus to our device. We talk about the future and yes we are living in the future right now but we don't know yet because right now Homey Pro is available on the market you can order from Homey website of course the price is 399 US dollars if you live in the US and of course it's 399 euro if you're living in Europe. In this video we're gonna cover about Homey Pro, Homey Bridge and of course if that is not enough we're gonna talk about Homey Pro Ethernet adapter that give us the possibility to connect now the Homey Pro to Ethernet and to Internet. Okay, let's focus on Homey Pro. What is Homey Pro? I will start with a small story because in Romania we install solar panels and we have a problem when we have a lot of excess of the energy because we don't want to feed that energy to the grid. We want to use that energy in our home in order to power something. For example, I want to use the excess of the energy to turn on my charging station and of course in the winter I want to turn on the heat pump and in the summer I want to turn on the AC and even more I want to turn on the pool uh, filtration system with my excess of the energy and this give us a lot of troubles because if you if we want to do this we need to call an electrician and of course we need to make some wires to modification our system in order to connect the inverter to our loads and this is a pain into the back of our system so we noticed uh, three years ago the homey pro the version that was uh, 2019 made and in that moment we decide to invest more in homey because it's a home automation hub in my opinion in mo this moment on the market i think is the most powerful home automation smart that you can find with the most beautiful home user interface and of course the possibility to be connected via iphone ipad browser app uh, watch app and even from the i don't know the car app because we make some tiktoks and we connect to homey from our car uh, browser so homey it's a home automation hub please keep in mind homey needs internet in order to work for example if you install homey in your home please be very careful when you install the alarm system homey is not designed to be an alarm system because once the internet is down all the users that receive information from your home won't receive that information because like I told you homey depends of internet even you are if you are at home and internet is down you cannot use the app because app will be connected to homey servers and of course all the information will be sent back from servers to your app so if the internet is broke this line of connection is interrupted and of course you cannot use homey uh, with the internet down so please keep this in mind before we start Okay, before we start, let's talk about Homey. We have Homey Pro, we have Homey Bridge and like I told you, Homey Adapter. I will talk right now in this first part of the video about Homey Pro. I will make a small unboxing because I want to show you also what you can find inside. And let's start with this Welcome Home Quick Start Guide, give you the information how you connect Homey to internet and of course how you connect Homey to power line. On the back you have a QR code that gives you the possibility to install the app in your mobile phone because you must commission this one first time from your phone is most easy and most uh, user friendly uh, interface. Let's remove this protection foil and let me show you how Homey works. If you look closer, looks like a CD in my opinion, it's a thick CD and of course it's full of technology but I will keep you posted right now. Let's see 
what you, you find in the box. You have a USB-C to USB-C and of course you have a USB-C to 223 volts because we are living in Europe. If you're living in the US, be very careful when you order from home your website. If you live in the US, order the US version. If you live in Europe, order European version because there are some difference between frequency from the technologies that you can find inside. So let's go inside and talk about technology. Even looks very, very small and very thin. This is full, full of technology. Most of them are not released right now in the market. I noticed in beta version from the Apple iOS system that include that, that new technology from the next year. So we're going to talk about the technology. First technology that you find inside is Wi-Fi. This device is able to communicate with your Wi-Fi router. If you have 2.5 gigahertz or 5 gigahertz connection, this homie is able to communicate. This gives the possibility to connect to internet and of course give the possibility to connect with Wi-Fi connected devices. For example, you have Sonoff that is connected to Wi-Fi, homie connect to Sonoff via Wi-Fi, so need Wi-Fi connection. The second technology is Z-Wave. Z-Wave is more worldwide used and of course right now they are on 700 chip, so this chip is the most powerful that you can find on the Z-Wave family right now. Uh, this mean that is more uh, has a huge power in order to extend the network. Z-Wave is a mesh network, you know, a device communicates with other devices and the network will be extended. But right now, Home include the most powerful chip that gives you the possibility to communicate with the new one and of course with the old Z-Wave devices. So you are not limited about Z-Wave. But keep in mind the newest chip is inside and is very powerful. The second technology that you can find inside is Bluetooth 5.0. Bluetooth gives you the possibility to connect with Bluetooth devices. Me, in my case, I cannot, I don't have any Bluetooth device in order to communicate with Homey. So the technology is inside. We don't know what device we find on Bluetooth, but we move to the next piece of technology that is Zigbee. Zigbee is more used in lights. For example, you have the Philips Hue, you have the IKEA brands that is connected to Zigbee. Even if you live in Europe, you have the Lidl brand that connect with uh, Homey via uh, Zigbee. Zigbee chip that is inside is 3.0, is the most powerful chip. Basically, Homey is the most powerful home automation hub. The next piece of technology that you can find inside is old one, but it's still used in some devices. For example, in gate opener or garage door opener, it's radio frequency 433 megahertz. Basically, that uh, chip is very old and Homey broadcast information uh, to that chip, but please keep in mind, homie don't have enough power to send uh, messages 200 meters away because the radio frequency cannot work on this distance. If you plan to open the gate via radio frequency, you need to install between gate and homie pro a homie bridge that act as a repeater but we will cover in the next part of the video the next technology that you can find inside it's infrared because here on the top you have a black cover transparent glass of course you have infrared leds infrared led give you the possibility to control the tv to control the ac that don't have wi-fi basically you install a a remote inside and give you the possibility to transmit the radio frequency and of course in this case infrared commands to your tv to your ac and to i don't know whatever device still use uh, infrared in order to communicate the next piece of technology that you can find inside are thread, thread and matter thread and matters uh, promise us to make a unified platform for whole world uh, home automation device like i told you even apple implement them in the new home kit so the matters is available right now thread will be available from the last part of this year but please keep in mind homey it's able to communicate with all that devices many many new uh, company that make home that make home automation device will move from z-way from zigbee to matter and thread because will be a unified platform worldwide we talk about technology and right now let's talk about the power of this unit because this unit needs to have a lot of power in order to process all this technology together and make flows and interconnect them so use a, a processor that is 1.8 gigahertz of course is very very powerful use 2 gigs of rams and of course has 8 gigs of ssd storage this now a... let's talk about scenes or rules or flows because homie rename all the scenes to flows we, you have three options in order to make flows in homie first option it's standard flows for example if a light is on 
turn on other lights. If a movement detected, please turn on the light for five seconds. This can be made very simple from web app, of course, and even from your mobile phone. Please keep in mind you still have another option in order to make uh, flows. If you are a coding guy or you are a programmer, you have the option to write uh, your own code in Homey because Homey script is available in Homey Pro. Last but not least, we have advanced flow that give us the possibility to make flows more advanced. This version is available only on web version because you need a lot of room in order to make this flow, but you can use a uh, not red style or home auto home kit, I think, and uh, not home kit, home assistance, in order to make some rules, some flows. Basically, you have the blocks, but you connect the blocks via lines, and this gives you the possibility to extend your rules more and more efficient for your entire home. This is the Homey Pro. Please keep in mind, if you are if you are a gadget guy like me, you want to talk with Siri, you want to talk with Google, you want to talk with Alexa. Please keep in mind, Homey support all of these assistants so you can connect with Siri, with Siri shortcuts, you can connect with Alexa, and of course you can connect with Google and make rules. For example, when you say, hey Siri, turn on the lights, and Siri is sleeping right now, okay? And you can turn on the lights, you can turn off the lights, or you can control everything in your home based on your voice. So this is Homey Pro. Now, if you plan to extend your home range with more devices or if you have a huge home you need a device that is able to communicate and cover the entire area for example you have a basement where homey is not able to send information because you have a very 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 thick uh, floors homey is not able to broadcast information there via radio frequency or via infrared or via z-wave or zigbee so in that case you can use a homey bridge as a satellite let me show you how homey bridge looks in reality and i will explain you how satellite mode works in reality first the same welcome home and this is homey bridge i will remove the protection in the package you have an usb to micro usb and of course you have a micro usb adapter of course I forgot to mention you can use your phone adapter in order to power Homey or Homey Bridge because consumption is very, very low. So this is Homey Bridge. Homey Bridge looks similar to Homey Pro, but if you put together, you notice the difference. This is more thicker and of course this is thinner. And of course the color differs. This is gray, this is black. Homey Pro is black, USB-C. Homey Bridge is gray, gray and of course micro USB. Homey Bridge acts as a repeater in some cases if you use as a bridge or a satellite mode. For example, we have a gate that is located over here and use 433 megahertz in order to open. We send an information from your phone, open the gate. Information will be sent to Homey. Homey will try to broadcast radio frequency but cannot cover the gate. So in that case, Homey know that already have a Homey bridge as a satellite inside. He will not broadcast the information via uh, radio frequency. He will broadcast information via Wi-Fi and this Homey bridge will send information and cover the area and of course open the uh, gate. I never test more than one satellite in Homey Pro. Uh, I receive only one homey bridge and i don't know if you can install more homey bridge but i think the satellite mode can be extended in different uh, different methods with many of these devices okay in the end i want to talk about homey ethernet adapter homey pro ethernet adapter basically it's an adapter that gives you the possibility to connect homey to ethernet and of course it's an usb-c to ethernet and of course here on the side you have an option to connect the power supply this gives you the possibility to connect homey to cable if you don't have enough uh, wi-fi uh, signal for example if you put home in the cabinet or if you put home in the basement in the technical room you want to homey to be controlled via ethernet and of course this satellite will be installed all over the house to cover all the area now I want to talk about the technology that you can install inside because I explained you what technology is available. All that you can find over here is still available over here, but keep, please keep in mind matter and thread is not available on the Homey Bridge. If you look on the price on their website, you will notice this one is 399 euro and this one is around 79 euro. You will be if you want to buy this one because it's more cheap, but please keep in mind if you plan to install your Tesla, if you plan to install an inverter, if you plan to install an AC, or if you plan to install any app that is not made by Atom, 
then you need a Homey Pro. Before you buy, please keep in mind, this one needs a subscription plan for each month. This one has no subscription. So basically you just buy once, you, you are able to install Homey app and of course developer app. And of course you have a lot, a lot of function like Advanced Flow or Homey Script, uh, Google Alexa, and even more. This one, it's internet based of course, but need a subscription in order to work. So if you decide to buy a Homey, please, before you do that, please check their app page and see what devices from your home it's available and what do you need. I think was enough for today. I think I explained you all that I know about Homey. I plan to make some videos where I will try to explain you how you can make a flow, how you can make a rule, how you can connect with uh, solar inverter because yes in Romania we install solar uh, inverter and solar system and we basically use this one first and uh, first uh, stage for connect uh, inverters to loads but in the end user decide that this is more powerful and they buy many many devices and of course their home become a very very smart and integrated home Whew. okay I hope you understand something from this video if you don't understand and if you don't know what I'm trying to explain here, write me in the comment area below. If you want to ask me something, again, write in the comment area below. I will try my best to answer to all of your questions because English is very, very unknown -no in some cases for me. <laughs> so I hope this video was good enough for you. If you decide we need to like, subscribe or share, don't hesitate, hit the bell, hit the subscribe button. And of course, we wait you in the next video. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.